What time is it? You know what time it is. It's time to hit that subscribe button. You know just where it's at. Right down there. Right down there. And it's time to find my Instagram. That's Geekly Amanda. G E E K O I Amanda. It's the same on Twitter. Make sure you follow me there too. And it's time to get this reaction review started. It is season 21, episodes 1 through 4, that I want to review. And I know some people are like, where's your Mahabharat been? Where's your Mahabharat reviews been? I've been struggling. Because not only did the site I was watching it, like, totally disappear or whatever, but then I found some more. And, and this whole season, like, the subtitles was messed up. Everywhere I looked, no subtitles. Everywhere I looked, they were messed, either they were messed up or no subtitles. So... Eventually, I was like, I'm just going to have to try to figure this out. <laughs> I'm just going to try to figure it, watch this and figure it out what's going on. And don't even give me, like, I didn't even finish when our Jew, our Krishna was given the special, uh, the special, you know, um, what do they call it? The yogis and all that to, to Arjun from, from what are the, the, Beat a give. I can't say words today. <laughs> you know what I'm talking about. The special lessons to Arjun. I couldn't even finish that last one. So I'm going to have to go back and do those. Which I need to go back anyway because they are so deep that I feel like it's going to take some time to really study it and understand it. So this picked up kind of like before, you know, a little bit, a lesson still that Krishna's given the Arjun. Well, I think they're right at the end because I think Arjun's like, show yourself too many it shows all the the heads that he has and he opens his mouth remember when like when a little krishna when he's little and he opens his mouth you could see like the entire universe in it like he does all that for arjun so then it kind of starts off with that but then the the first episode they're they're like he's like boom we're we're, we're everything everybody's unfrozen now <laughs> everybody's unfrozen war the war's starting the ha the horns are going off Things are getting crazy. And of course, over there in the hand support, you got the, the blind king and that one guy. What's his name? Oh, Sanjay. Is that his name? Kind of narrating things, uh, what's going on. I mean, that must be a, something. That must be something to have to, like, just tell you, tell uh, the, the, the blind king everything that's going on and what's happening over there. I wouldn't want that job. I <laughs> the way things are getting crazy. I mean, you got uh, everybody coming head to head. What was it first? It was like, oh, Drona and Drapod? See, this is the thing, because like, they'll show them coming head to head. And that's a good thing, though. I didn't have a lot of subtitles. Like, I didn't have the subtitles for this. There was mostly action, which I did miss some of the, the subtitles. Like, first, Drona and Drapod coming head to head. They, they balance stuff. But then they had words back and forth to each other. And I'm like, what are they saying? What are they saying? What's what's Drapod telling him and what's Drona telling him? Like these are the dialogues I'm missing. Although, you know, I can get a little feel for it just by like the you know, attitudes like who was it next? It was uh it was somebody, was it Drapod? Oh no, it was uh Arjun and Drona when they because they, they kind of went head to head for something and then you know have and they had some words to say back and forth which I didn't know what they're saying but then you can also kind of like get a little uh just from their actions kind of know the tone like like they were smiling and and Arjun like even like did like this like I think he was asking for like his blessings and things right he even did like this and I was like oh like they're on the battlefield, but they being friendly. Drapod and Drona were going back and forth. I was, I thought Drona was gonna get killed, cause that Drapod didn't he like pull an arrow and he shot an arrow at it, and Drona just standing there like, give it to me, give it to me, and he was stuck with it. I was like, oh, he's dead already. I was thinking he's dead already. So yeah, he had that arrow stuck in him. He pulled it right out and he just threw it, tossed it aside. And then there's his son. That, I call him the crystal head boy. You know, he was there and he was there to fight. He's over there fighting just as much. Right. Then I think it's like Bishma and isn't that, well, what is that kid's name? It's, I think it's Arjun's son. Right? That's what I've been calling him, Arjun's son. I forgot his name. He's the one that recently got married, right? Well, then him and Bisha have words. So I was like, what are they saying now? Whatever he said, like special Arjun's son, whatever he told him, because you know right before that, he did a little trick. He jumped out. He did like, he he flew out of like his chariot. He did all these little flips and stuff and landed. 
And there he is, like, ready for... But if I was Bishma, I'd be like, uh-oh. He got flips. I've never seen Bishma do a flip. <laughs> I've never seen him. But whatever he told Bishma, like, Bishma looked like he was shocked. He was like, what? He was like... So I was like, it's killing me not knowing these subtitles. I'm like, what are they saying to each other? I get the gist of it. And with all the action, I kind of know what happens. But I, I want to know, like, are they smack talking each other? I could just, I should put in like my own words, you know? Because like, <laughs> you know, like the, the Arjun's son jumps, flies out the chair, he does all these flips and then lands and Bishma's like, cool story, bro. I can do that. <laughs> it wouldn't be like that. But I'm just saying, like, these are just things going on in my head while they're talking and I have no idea what they're saying. ain't even worried about him with his flips and his flying across because, right, he, like, shot an arrow and I was like, Bishma done caught it. And then he's like, that's all you got? And he, like, threw it aside. I was like, oh! Bishma's a powerhouse out there. Bishma is a powerhouse and I kind of remember how he, like, I know he, like, he dies in this war, and, and I feel like he, like, kind of sacrificed himself. I don't, like, it's coming up, I'm going to find out. But I'm just, like, I, at this point, I'm like, ain't nothing going to get Bishma. Bishma came back, Bishma jumped out of that thing. <laughs> he jumped out of the chariot, doing his own little tricks. He can't do flips at all, but he was just, like, and, and they going back and forth fighting. They are. Then you got over here, Yudi and all them, like, they all trying to stay together, right? They all trying to stay together, fighting and having each other's backs and over Yudi over here. And then I think like those, then over, he's fighting like, he got Shakuni and, and the mean prince and that brother. Oh, that brother still gets up. Like he even fights Goofy. <laughs> he, even, he even jumps out of his chair and he's all, Arr! and I'm like, he even fights Goofy. That brother, I can't stand him. I don't know why. I think he just, everything he does gets on my nerves. But obviously they got some plots going on. They got some plots that they want to try to get Yudi and and even like do some like scheming, not fair stuff. Like they're going to shoot him in the back, right? That's what they're, they're like. You're going to go and because I had read something. I'm like, I'm going to have to read some of what's happened in this war because I can't understand what they're saying, <laughs> you know. So and from a little bit, I get some of the subtitles. They're like, let's let's, you know, cut off Yudi. Like some of the subtitles come up. So I got a little bit of that too, but it seems like they t they teamed up. To, they want to take down Yudi. I guess they thought taking the big brother out of, will just like wreck the Pandavas and do a kind of scheme and like, I'll, I'll fight him and then you shoot him in the back and had the one guy, what's his name? Salve or something like that. Shoot him while they're fighting him in the back. I was like, always dirty with them. It always got to be dirty with them. And then what happens? Oh, right, because they shot, and that was like the last. That was like the last moment, because you're like, right, the sun, and they was watching too. That shit, Cunny's always looking. This is what's, what's the sun look like? Is the sun down? He's always keeping his eye on there. So like the sun was coming down. They blowing the horn. You think it's all over? Everybody stops, and they they done that guy shot Yudi, and you think it's missed because you see Yudi's there, but then that Utar. Right, blocks it and takes the, the arrow for him. Isn't that the little boy when they were trying to hide their identities for a year in that country? And that's that King Virat's son, right? Wasn't he the one that Arjun, when he was dressed like a woman, was like, let's go out with the chair. You ride the chair. I'm going to be your charioteer. And you, and he like did the arrow and it went like this. Is that the same boy? Because I was like, first of all, he's young. I was like, he is young to be fighting, too young to be fighting in this war. And second, like, if he, that is, he sure did practice, like, his archery skills better before this. <laughs> but that was, like, the first life taken, right? Or one of them, of the characters, like, we really know. And, and it has to be a little boy. Oh, my heart broke on that. Especially give his life to save Yudi on top of it. And then you think everything's all right, and then they're gonna trick you because he's there, and and then you see that he's been he's been shot, and then you're just like, oh no. And then that whole thing, oh, was that breaking your heart when they having to like do his funeral kind of thing, bringing him back, and you see the girls because they had that girl, that the little girl there, isn't that his sister that's married to the Arjun's son? I get it all confused. <laughs> I get them all confused, but 
she was like over there crying. I was like, I think that's his sister the, of the boy that died. And then you, you, all the women, I mean, that was like a scene though too, right? Like it, the horn, and it was sundown and the women are just waiting there for their, the, the men to come back. And it's just like, you're waiting to see who comes back alive or not. Ah, oh, can't imagine. Then you got them over in the Kuro side. Cause they, I guess they won, they kind of won, right? They killed the little boy. They did pretty good standing their ground and stuff. And they over there celebrating, right? You got them. I think they were drinking and, and breaking pots of cunning and, and, and the mean prince and the, and the aggravating brother. They were there drinking and breaking pots and all this stuff. And I was like, you over there celebrating this just day one. You think Pandavis is they, they're going to come back even madder <laughs> tomorrow. You just killed this little boy. He saved you his life. They're going to have plans for you. Bishma knows. Bishma knows because they went up there walking in. Because Bishma's over there. They're having, you know, the injured in there. The, the ones like on stretchers. And Bishma's there doing work. And those guys off drinking and, and partying. Then they want to come in like, and walk in all strutting like tough guys to Bishma who's in this tent with these people that are hurt. And talk smack. I don't even know what was said. But I was still yelling at the TV. I was still yelling like, no, nah, I was. Because they get on my nerves. I don't even know what they were saying. I think they were. This is what I think, though. I think they were like, you know, huffing and, oh, look, we did great today. We're going to take them out. You know, their little, what's your plan? What's your plan to take the rest out? And Bisham is like, don't, you know, don't just be all this confident after today. Because the Pandavas, he was like, they're going to come back. And they're going to be mad and they're going to come back stronger. You better be ready for it. Then it ends with the Pandavas. I mean, they do. They're coming back with a plan. They, they want to hold that. What did they have a whole plan? They want to like kidnap, capture the, the mean prince and and all this kind of stuff. I was like, yeah, get your, you better get your plans down. Because day one was not very good for you. And then poor Krishna. <laughs> I'll say poor Krishna. But I mean, I couldn't imagine being that. You're in the middle of it. You're in the middle of all this fight and stuff. And you can't do nothing. Like, he's just sitting there. And he's watching. Like, he's, I think, right? They showed him when, when you that Utah got killed. And you could just see the pain in his face and eyes. And But he can't do nothing. Like, he, even if he saw that arrow, okay, he can't get involved. So, I got, how terrible must that be to be in a position in the middle well, yeah, you're the chariot and stuff, but you still, you can't fight. You can't save anybody. You see this arrow coming, you can't stop it. You just have to let, <sighs> let fate take its course is what I was going to say. Because that's what it is, right? I mean, it was fate for this stuff to happen. And look, we're talking about poor little Utah sacrificing his life for Udi, even thousands and thousands and thousands of years later after this happened. <laughs> so, I mean... <laughs> was fate but it's still it's not it's not easy to watch and i can't imagine just it's not easy to watch just on the tv i can't imagine being there and i ain't being able to do nothing and having to watch through that well there's important things i missed y'all please tell me especially with the dialogues between everything because this is so frustrating but i'm like there's nothing i can do i just have to do the best i can and it looks like the next episode actually the beginning of season 22 the subtitles looked all right. Well, I don't know. I only looked at the first episode. I hope it lasts because I love these. You know I love these. And you know, everybody's asking where they at. And I'm like, I know. I want to watch it too. I'm at the end. I'm at the last part. The war. The big war. And I can't get, like, they're messing up more and more for me. So well, let's just cross our fingers and hope that it works. <laughs> it works through all these next seasons because... And we don't have very many more. Like this is 21 and even 20 and they're shorter seasons, right? Like 22 is only like five episodes. This was only one episode and it goes to 28. So yeah, we're at the end. I need to finish it. All right, y'all. Let me know what you think. Comments, thumbs, all that. Until next time. Mwah.